My dear viewers, welcome to this reading. This reading is for all Gemini and it's for October, a little bit over 2024. All about your career, your finances, everything about your money, Gemini. So let's see what are important factors for you to know around your work, your career, your finances and all your money. Starting with, the, we're going to start with first by saying welcome everybody. Welcome my dear friends, my dear viewers, um, my dear Gemini. Welcome all. Thank you all for being here. Let us begin to see what is the most important message for you for October. Starting with the first one, glasses on. And we've got the Smith. This is about taking action, but it's also about overthinking. If you are overthinking something too much, you really have to pay attention so that you're not overthinking something too much. Or at least maybe the overthinking will help you take action, but you are going to be taking action. That's for sure. In regard to something maybe that you've been over overthinking, over and over, you're finally going to take action and put it, put it to rest. Now, let's take the second message for all Gemini, October. And it says we've got the tailor. The tailor is all about paying attention to detail. Also, not letting the pride, your pride, stand in the way. Uh, having pride, of course, standing for what you believe in, without a doubt, but not letting pride stand in your way. And paying attention to detail. Very important. These are the two important messages for every Gemini October onwards regarding your work career so that you know okay we're moving on to the next level and now we're going to take two messages from this deck to see what blessings are coming what important factors are going to take place for you my dear Gemini starting with the first one and we've got wisdom is needed that means putting your intellect your logic everything your practicality into play but at the same time listening to your gut feeling when there is that gut feeling saying to you something inside saying no or yes go for it listen use your wisdom use everything but use your you use use your wisdom and and think wisely like um your your logic and um your intellect and your gut feeling when you're taking action and ag again paying attention to detail but you are taking action so whatever action you take use your wisdom and the next message for all gemini we have transformations major transformations beautiful ones are happening with a butterfly that are going to uplift you transcend you to high level so whatever is happening whatever uh, changes are taking place it's going to be permanency and uploading you up uplifting you to higher levels so prepare for amazing changes that's really wonderful to know now we're going to take on two more messages from this deck all gemini starting with the first one and we've got the moon and the moon is all about um it's about clarity and seeing the truth and revelations and secrets being revealed so that you can see your path very clearly and you know exactly where you're heading and what you're doing um, this is very important and clarity and transparency without a doubt. So anything hidden is going to be revealed. Let's have a look at the second message for all Gemini. And we've got the four of pentacles, inheritance, unexpected large amount of money, life changing money, big amount of money coming your way. So that's beautiful. I'll, cl I'll clarify some of them as we go along. So that's that one. Now I'm going to take two important messages very important messages from this deck here to for all gemini starting with the first one and we've got the two of wands you may be thinking um about movement um choices decisions some of you could be relocating or considering a relocation some of you could be relocating um in regard to work that could be a relocation we'll see one more one more message and the next one is, yes, I see. This is about the Six of Cups. This is about leaving the past behind you. Even though it had good memories, it was wonderful. But leaving it behind and moving away from it. Leaving it behind and healing from it. You are going to go through healing uh, from this uh, past. I'll just put this stuff like that. Here we go. The Six of Cups. Okay. Now, let's move on to the next level. Now that we have established all this, we're going to go through and see what else do you need to know. We're going to take four cards, four messages for every Gemini for October onwards and see what's got, what you need to know. One card only this time. Starting with the first one, it says something's falling apart. Something 
is ending in your life, this chapter or this person or this situation is being removed from your life because it has no more future. It won't benefit your highest good. So it's being removed. Maybe that's why revelations are coming about and also um, decisions about leaving. Because it won't do any good for you anymore. There is great news coming. This great news is going to give you the go-ahead to move forward. You'll be able, that's why they said here, you are going to be taking action. Yes, you will be. Um, don't overthink it. It's got to be so clear and you'll know exactly what action to take. It won't be difficult. I feel like leaving in the past, leaving something behind and moving forward. The next one says a lot of your wishes and dreams. This is a wish card, wish fulfillment card. A lot of your wishes are going to be fulfilled. So you don't have to worry at all. No matter what happens, your wishes are going to be fulfilled. And then it says you should have left some time ago, but you've been procrastinating for so many reasons. Now you'll know that the only right answer is to let go and move forward. That is that. The, what is hidden from you is the moon and a lot of money the high priestess wow so what's hidden is the moon and we've got the moon here again so you got the moon twice a lot of truth is coming out and um a lot of a lot of uh things will happen to show you your path you'll know how to move forward but at the same time again we've got money coming in have a look at that we've got the four of pentacles which is unexpected money coming big amounts uh, this, which sometimes can be inheritance. The Six of Pentacles, which is having so much money to the point we'll see, where you start doing charities and helping others, those who are in need. So this is really spectacular. Money all over the place. Hmm, very nice. Okay, what you don't see coming, what you don't see coming, and then we've got the moon. Okay, now we're going to take three messages from another deck. Three, for all Gemini October onwards. We got the first one, I'll put it over here. The second one for all Gemini, October. We got the golden wings and the next last one, all Gemini, and we got the pendulum. Okay, so let's have a look at these messages. And it seems to me like you, some of you might be actually thinking of starting a new career or starting a new job or even starting your own business because this is all about... Um, organizing and, and looking at your accomplishments. Some of you might even think about um, starting a business, self-employment, or even perhaps getting more skills. Uh, steady income is there without a doubt. Some of you are really going to consider self-employment, working from home, working um, uh, for your business, for your own business, for your own um, thing, or working with others in a business, family business. There could be careers in art or design, but um, and some careers in home oriented situation like home oriented work or careers also possible but looking at your accomplishments now the golden wings are spectacular this is all about profit this is about rising above money issues business taking off if you are doing a business a lot of profits it's about some of you could be considering spiritual work um, you know helping with life's purposes mission and so forth but this is really wonderful. This is like transcending you to high levels with a lot of uh, spirituality and wisdom. The pendulum is all about fluctuating income, but it is also about indecision. Like we have the two of ones, sort of like questioning things. Should I do this or shouldn't I? Like wondering, um, make trying indecisive. Uh, but it says a new strategy is needed. You are going to put implement a new strategy in your life. And it looks like to me, some of you, in regard to your career, might be considering seasonal work, uh, changing your job and making new choices. So this is all about making choices, just like the two of wands. Now, I'll have a sip of water and we move on to the next level. The next level, just to see what the animal spirit has to tell you. For all Gemini, we're going to take two cards. We've got the turkey spirit, which is all about give with gratitude and grace give you are going to be i feel like you are going to be quite wealthy some money is coming that's why they're saying give with gratitude and grace you are protected i feel like you are going to be healing an area of your life where you are empowered to help others so that's really great news just like one of your wishes coming true or not one a few of your wishes coming true and the next one says the chameleon is all about action, taking action now. All the changes that are taking place, the transformation. This chameleon is about both of these together. So um, transformation, no, sorry, it's this one and that one. Transformation with the chameleon, changes that are taking place. Um, a lot of success is coming. Take action now. Don't, 
don't hesitate. Don't be hesitant. Take action because you are going to be doing well as you take action. So that's really good good news. And we're going to take two more messages from this deck, then I'll clarify the cards for all Gemini. October. It says, navigate by the stars. Follow your bliss. There's a lot of blessings coming your way. Follow them. You shouldn't even worry about anything because um, it's like they're letting you know that so much blessings are going to be leading the way for you. They'll be showing you. You'll be guided the way. Just the transformations, my dear Gemini. Yes, again, stepping into power. You are going to be so empowered. You are strong beyond measure. And if you haven't felt it and you, you don't think you are, you will be strong be beyond measure. So that's what's coming. That's really wonderful. Absolutely beautiful to know. Right. Now, let's clarify some of the cards and see what else you need to know. Is there anything else? Now, let's have a look at what is collapsing, what is falling apart with the tower. It shows that, oh, wow, this shows like, you know, you'll be doing the right thing. That's for sure. What you are going to be, you are going to be doing what is right. But at the same time, it shows that you are committed to, to some situation. And it looks like to me there could be inheritance where you are, you, you become the executor of this but you will do the right thing by your siblings or by anybody concerned uh because the four of pentacles is inheritance large amounts of money inheritance or they could be coming out of a lottery or, or a lotto play the lotto or the lottery even if you play five ten dollars a coffee cup worth once a month as long as you're there every month use the lucky numbers that were given to you they're in the community section of this channel there are three consecutive years you were given batches of numbers lucky numbers for every sign go into the community section of this channel and uh, next to playlist community you'll see community go inside it and uh, when you click on it you will see a post says lucky numbers you click on that and you'll see all the signs so go on there gemini and grab the numbers and play them i do feel like something major is going to happen you are going to rise beyond money money matters so that means you are going to be empowered i also feel like you are going to be so empowered that you are going to be um, supporting others those who are in need you are going to be supporting them there's a lot of money coming your way so this is the time to take advantage of it and uh, play because i feel like it's time the heavens i think the heavens are showing that this is divine timing for you to be um transcendent above and all your money issues are going to be over. So a lot of abundance is coming, life-changing abundance. And you are going to have your wishes come true. So it shows that you will be doing the right thing when this money comes. And something is falling apart because, um, they, oh my God, we were doing this. We were asking about this. Do you see that here, right here? We asked about this um, tower. And we got the tower. And the answer for the tower was was um, doing the right thing and a lot of money coming in so you are going to be doing the right thing hmm. some of you are leaving a situation without a doubt okay let's have a look at your wishes and wishes fulfilled fulfill the nine of cups right it looks like some of you are leaving you see leaving because due to too many reasons one of the reasons could be that you're not happy where you are there may be conflict there may be problems You've been procrastinating, knowing that you have to leave, but holding off and not wanting to take action. Finally, now you're going to actually take action and move. You could be moving away from someone of water energy, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. Have a look at your general reading. At the end of it, you'll know which water energy this is. It also shows that there could be someone very caring and considerate that might be supporting you to move forward, and you might be moving forward. But there is a very suffocating chapter coming to an absolute ending. Something that's been too much on your shoulders, too much responsibilities is coming to an end. Let's have a look at what, with the moon, what is hidden and what is, what is going to show you? What is going to release you? Well, it shows hard work is going to pay off. You have to pay attention to detail, just like they said here with the tailor. Very important. You need to pay attention to details so that you don't make mistakes, so that you don't lose money, so that you don't sign documents and, you know, money is taken from you. Very, very careful. You don't make any mistakes whatsoever. 
so that you don't incur losses. Very careful. And the other factor is the moon is going to release you. By showing you the truth, you will know where the truth is, where it lies, and you will choose your path accordingly and move. You are feeling restricted, and you are going to let go and move forward. Something is hidden from you. Soon it will show you. Your higher self is trying to tell you uh, there could be a Virgo coming into your life or a fire energy where you're taking action. Let's have a look at the Two of Wands for all Gemini. What is the Two of Wands? The sun is going to be shown, but there's another card. Right, you are elevated. Your status is going to heighten. You're going to rise, I think, with this money. This is about money that uplifts you to high levels. You're transcended to high levels. Um of victory after victory the sun shining giving you radiant success and a lot of healing bringing someone wonderful also in support of you this is the time where you are considering relocation and you are leaving a situation that you didn't want to leave you were procrastinating but ultimately you are going to leave and it's after this leaving uh, and it could be a separation from uh, for some of you let's have a look now at the seven of swords itself that you were supposed to leave and you've been procrastinating what is that all about Yes, now it's time for, tea for you to actually take place because there is someone coming into your life, someone that's going to be very supportive, someone incredible, Earth energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, where you are going to be exceptionally happy and have your wishes and dreams come true. Just like we have the Nine of Cups here, and now we've got the Ten of Cups and someone incredible that is going to be quite supportive to uplift you, to, to support you, to be with you all the way. You could This could be a business partner. You could be um, working for someone, having your own business together or, you know, working together or doing something amazing together. But it is part of your wishes come true and a lot of dreams come true also. So while you were procrastinating and not leaving a situation, destiny is going to help you move. It's, it's, a, it's actually destiny that's taking you and putting an end to a suffocating chapter. And that's where the money comes in. Look at that. So a suffocating chapter ends and then you get all this money. This is ending. That's why they've got, they're showing the money. There's a lot of money coming your way. And um, and this is where it gives you the power. Absolute power. I'll put it over here. There you go. Absolute power. Um, that helps you help others, do charities. You can do so much. There's so much to do. Absolutely so much. So money to the highest level and degree. And, um, yes, so I'll leave that there. Now I'm going to have a look at the news that's coming. The Knight of Swords for all. What's the, the good news that's giving you the go-ahead? Well, the news is connected to someone of fire energy, Sagittarius, Aries, Leo. Also somebody that has earth energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. I feel like these two people could be the ones that are uh, offering you something, maybe. There could be an offer. There could be someone supportive. Very, both very caring, very supportive, very, yeah, exceptionally supportive. I feel like a major change is coming. These people are going to uplift you and take you to the next level. Let's have a look at the Four of Pentacles. This money, this money is going to give you expansion and power. Power over your life. Power and control over your journey. You will be an authority. Like I said, an authority of the situation, this amount of money. An authority could be given a leadership position. But there is expansion and a lot of rewards coming your way. So this is part of the reward system here for you. A new beginning, um, an absolute healing, compensation, new lease of life. This is going to be tremendous. You are going to be loving this. This is going to be a lot of um, situations ending and great situations beginning, great beginning that transcends you to a level of like starting over and being very powerful this time. Empowered, starting over. So the judgment card is just incredible. This is going to put an end to a lot of battles, a lot of disagreements, an absolute end. The situation was overwhelming you, suffocating you, too many responsibilities, too many headaches, all coming to an end. Absolutely. And then finally there's wealth and abundance destined for you. Generations, legacies of wealth, big amounts of money coming that are going to be very inspirational for you. You are going to be celebrating big time, this amount of money. Again, I will show you what I see here. There's a lot of money coming in that's going to help you, you know, become quite powerful 
and um, destiny intervening without a doubt in this regard destiny helping you to get this power I'll just put this one here destiny supporting you to be uplifted this way and a lot of a lot to be grateful for a lot of celebrations extraordinary celebrations coming your way so that is um, incredible absolutely yeah yes I was just thinking of something and I just lost it <laughs> I was in the middle of thinking there was something I wanted to say in regard to all this. Yeah, so it looks to me like you are going to be taking action, and ultimately, you have a beautiful destiny to celebrate where you are going beyond uh, money issues. You are rising above money matters. You're making a lot of profits, a lot of money, and a lot of happiness is coming your way where you will really not need any anything and I feel like you are going to be supported there are people supporting you especially the earth energy which we saw this you can see who this person is and you're destined for a lot of happiness um, in your general reading at the end of it have a look at this earth energy it's this earth energy has started showing in your reading there is someone of earth energy which is either Virgo Taurus or Capricorn coming into your life and supporting you and being with you all the way like your right hand where you walk hand in hand you're feeling supported you're not alone and that's finally where you are going to get all your happiness so my dear Gemini have a look for this uh, in your general reading at the end of it that should tell you who this person is and that is the end of your reading I hope you enjoyed it do give me a thumbs up let me know what you think please watch the videos all the way to the end in support of me and don't forget to subscribe to the channel it doesn't cost anything a click only of a moment of your time and that would help me big time I wish you abundance of blessings in everything you do namaste